Uh, my name is Mirako, and I'm really excited to be with you today because this show marks the 10 year anniversary of when the Artisan program started and I first started working with Sony. And look it, now they are the number one mirrorless camera brand. Pretty cool, right? Uh, so I do family portraits. I have a show on the Disney Junior Channel, maybe some of you have seen. And I wanna talk to you about what my favorite features are with my equipment. Uh, so one of the things that I love to do is I love to capture deep shadows. How many of you like shadows in your photography? I love just to like have the shadows that tell emotion. I feel like it adds a moodiness to it. And this is all with window light, okay? So um, basically the reason I'm able to get these deep shadows and have detail in it is because of the dynamic range in the Sony cameras. I'm shooting with an A7R3 and if I'm not getting deep shadows, I like to go to the other extreme and get that bright light. Okay, how many of you shoot into the light? You shoot, okay, good, good. I love shooting right into the sun because then what happens is this bright light comes through to the camera and it feels like it adds even more joy, even more connectiveness with the uh, subjects in my shadows. So then um, dynamic range is helping me get both the highlights and the details in that as well as in the shadows. This is a shot that I did uh, just recently of this mom and baby. And one of the things that I was using for this shot is the IAF, which is the eye autofocus. And I'm gonna have in just a few minutes a model come up here, um, a few of them actually. And I'm gonna demonstrate for you how amazing the IAF feature is because basically what it does is it locks focus on the subject's eye and then it tracks them. So other camera brands are talking about IAF, but the difference with Sony's IAF is it's a continuous tracking. And so I'll show you when Nicole, my model, comes up here, because she's gonna like walk around the stage and you're gonna see that IAF tracker no matter where she goes. So for portraits, this is a big deal. How many of you take photos of uh, children? I'll say, okay. <laughs> and how many of you know that they are on the move, which I'm gonna demonstrate for you on this stage in a few minutes. Uh, so this dad is like going up and down with his little boy and his little boy is giggling and laughing. And what is so great is the IAF just grabs focus on that little boy's eye. And even though he's moving up and down, it never like unlocks focus. It keeps it the whole time. So how many of you have ever, and, and I'm, I'm, I've had this happen to me, but um, you've done a really great photo shoot you feel so good about, and you get home and you look at the photos, and all of a sudden you see that the focus grabbed on their shoulder versus their eye, or grabbed on their cheek versus their eye. And you know that like, well maybe on Instagram or social media, nobody will be able to tell, but if they were gonna blow it up to a 20 by 30 for their home, they're totally gonna see that. And so I think for portrait photography, that's why the IAF is so like, such a game changer. I'm using it still on this shot. This is in San Francisco, and this little boy is just like walking up the uh, log, and I don't have to worry about not getting his eye in focus, because that is just tracking with him the whole time. And then the craziest thing happened the other day. I was doing uh, a senior photo shoot in Dallas, and the IAF caught his eye through the sunglasses. <laughs> it was able to like detect his eye even though he had sunglasses on. And so uh, I'm gonna demonstrate this for you in a few minutes, but before that, uh, one of the biggest questions I get asked is what are your favorite lenses to shoot with? And I have two lenses that I absolutely love. One of them is the 85 millimeter uh, G Master lens. How many of you love the prime lenses? Like, that is such a big deal. Yes, I love to be wide open, to shoot at a, you know, 1.8 or uh, even lower. So something to think about with the Sony uh, native lenses is that they, Sony cameras have in-camera stabilization. And lots of times when you're buying your prime lenses, 
they don't have stabilization, stabilization on those lenses. I don't know why they don't give it to us, but they don't. Like, they'll give it to us for telephoto, but not the prime. And so that's something that I really depend on with the Sony camera. It's just that that a7R 3 it has the in-camera stabilization. So if I'm shooting in low light, I don't have to worry about, like, having motion blur. Does that make sense? Uh, this, this is shot with a 24 to 70, and some of my favorite shots come at the end of the photo shoot when everybody's just tired, <laughs> and they all collapse on mom or dad. And uh, I love that, like, she, like, first wrapped her arms around him, but her little brother wants to get in there, like, right away, too, right? So this is shot with a 24 to 70 F28 uh, G Master lens, and this, like, People ask me all the time, if you could only choose one lens, what would it be? And the 24 to 70 is always going to be that answer because it's just my workhorse lens. I'm going to use it on stage today. I can get in really tight or I can go like a little bit wider. And uh, to me, like, just having that versatility with still being able to get that yummy like light and the bokeh in there it's just like all of that is playing into capturing emotion not just their faces but how do i get the light to add to the emotion as well so this is a senior photo shoot in we lit this you can tell the sun is setting and you can kind of see the colors of the sunset on that aluminum so what we did is uh we took a light the uh, pro photo b10 and we put it over like if he's right here in front of me and this is a wall we set the light up like right here so it would pop light on his face but it would also feel like it was the sun setting so it doesn't look like artificial lighting how many of you like want your lighting to always look natural? Like that's me. I, I don't ever want it to look commercial or produced. I want it to feel like, oh, that's what the sun looked like at that moment. So whether, um, you know, whether you're doing family portraits of babies, we're going to have a baby come up here in a second, or whether you're doing uh, older kids, you need a camera system that you can depend on so that you can just focus on what you're doing because this right here is all about composition like how many of you like struggle with how do you put a group together how do you like position mom and dad so everybody looks like it doesn't look forced it doesn't look fake and um, I love that this dynamic happened where she's almost doing exactly what her mom is doing right and so for me like I, I want to be um, confident that my lens is what it needs to be, my camera's working the way, the eye autofocus is grabbing, so that I can just focus on them and how I want to set them up. So, later today, I'm going to do a talk all about locations and how to pick locations that are meaningful to your clients, uh, because however deep the meaning of the location is, even if it's just stone steps, something that simple, increases the value of what you can make off your portrait photography. So we're going to talk about that later today. I think it's like at 3.30. I know that there's a schedule or 3.45, sometime around then. But uh, what I want to do first is I want to do a shooting uh, live demo for you. How does that sound? So I'm just going to tell you right now, whenever I bring kids up here, I have no idea what's going to happen. <laughs> But I love doing that because how many of you know that's the reality of like photographing kids, right? So let's go ahead and set this up. We're going to set this backdrop up in the lighting. Um, Amy, I'm going to get ready to do this. Yep. So let me tell you what I have here. Well, first of all, I have my husband here. <laughs> I, he, he jumped in to be my lighting assistant today, and I thought, this is perfect, because if anything doesn't work, guess whose fault it is? <laughs> it's always his fault. <laughs> and so I have right here a Pro Photo Light. This is um, their 4x6 uh, modifier, and the reason I like this, it's so, it's so small, right? It's like you can almost, you can barely even see it. I know. Um, but the reason I love this light is because it's just, it gives you this yummy result. It, uh, 
I want my lighting to um, to copy window light. I want it to look like there wasn't a light use. Does that make sense? I want to create light. And so uh, this right here gives me um, just that great effect. Now, I've got a gravity backdrop set up here, and I've got this white chair right here. And the reason I have the white chair facing this way, I'm going to... I'm going to demonstrate for you why in a second. But first I'm going to have um, you come on up. Oh, Mimi, can you not? I just don't want it to be in the shot. Yeah. Can you come up, Nicole? All right. This is Nicole. Can I introduce him to you? Nicole is my model, my first one today. And she is 10 years old. Yes. And she um, aspires to being a model professionally someday. Is that right? So uh, we would just want to give her all the practice she, she can get. And so this is Nicole. So, honey, I'm going to have you do something really easy for me first. I'm going to have you stand on the um, other side of this chair. We won't use this chair right away. We'll, like, move this this way. Okay, I'm just going to have you stand right there. Perfect. And let's see here. All right. Thank you. Can all of you see both screens? Okay. What we are going to do... Yep. Okay, so I'm on channel 7A, which that should already be on. Okay, so I'm not going to take a photo just yet, but um, yes, it's working. Okay, so can you move that way just for, so they can see that? Okay, great. So what I want to do first, I thought I would like take this, take the challenge up one more step by not being able to see anything through my camera. <laughs> but it's okay because I'm going to show you this. This is absolutely crazy. Here's Nicole. She's beautiful. Look at that. Everyone see that? So this is what's so nuts. I'm not even going to look through my camera because I can't see anything anyways because you're seeing it up here. And Nicole, I just want you to walk back and forth and kind of try to keep looking at the camera. Yeah. Yeah, just take a couple steps that way, but look at the camera for me. Uh-huh, now walk this way. Everybody see that? So um, this, now walk towards me. Good job, perfect, now walk backwards. Okay, do you all see that? That, so I know other camera brands are talking about having eye autofocus. But Sony is the only one that tracks it in motion, where I don't even have to look through the camera and I know that it's grabbing IO focus. Raise your hand if you think that this is insanely amazing. I need to know who's listening. Okay, all right, good. <laughs> now, let's go ahead and take some shots of you. So go ahead and turn. Um, I'm going to have you come a lot closer to this light. Yeah. And Brian, let's bring down this light just a little bit more. And let's bring it towards Nicole just a little more too. All right, so I haven't any test shots. We're just gonna figure out the lighting together. Does that sound good? I have my um, ISO at 100, and I have my f-stop at f3.5. You can all see that right there, right? Okay, great. So let's see here, sweetie. Let's see what Give me just a little bit of a smile, yeah. All right, let's see how that light looks, first of all. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I'm so, <laughs> that looks awesome. I think we're okay. <laughs> I should not, I know this is something. The microphone guy is probably freaking out in the back with how high my voice just went. I know I should not be that excited about like me being able to take a photo, but there's a lot going on here, right? And so that's why I love camera okay here we go so honey I'm gonna have you bring your shoulder a little bit more towards me that one yes now turn at an angle I love that that is darling now bring your hands up a little bit to your um, right under your chin uh-huh yes and stand a little more facing that way the light aha uh -huh. yes 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 and I'm gonna go like this 
Oh my goodness, sweetie. You look absolutely stunning. Beautiful. Let's see that. Isn't that gorgeous, right? So now what I want you to do is I want you to kind of like, I'm gonna have her kind of like move around a little bit back and forth. And let's see, let's track, um, let's track the light with her. So what I want you to do is I want you to stand there and I want you to just be like, like this for me. Uh-huh. And I'm just gonna take a whole bunch of shots of you. Here we go. All right, did everybody see that? Let's see how that. Yes. Is this okay how we're, um, I'll let you do it. Okay. So I wanted to show you that even with like continuous uh, shooting mode, because I, with kids, I'm always in continuous. And I, you know, if I just push it down once, I'll just get one shot. But if I hold it down, I want that option to get several at a time. So let's have her move just a little bit faster. You're doing so good. Faster? Yeah. But hold on one second. Okay. All right. Whoops. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Okay, here we go. Move a little faster for me. Yes. Perfect. And go a little bit more. Yes, I love that. Okay, let's see here. Everyone see like I'm having her move to get like a natural energy out of her so she doesn't like feel stiff and like she can't do anything. Let's do something else. Let's, Brian, um, where'd Brian go? Can you hold this for one second? And um, honey, let's have this come right here. And I just want you to sit on the end of it like this, bring your shoulder a little bit forward and just look at me like this with your hand here, okay? All right, can I? I know this is weird. Can we try it though? <laughs> All right, honey, you look at the camera, and um, it, is her head in the frame? I cannot see because of the light, yeah? Okay, good. <laughs> oh, I love that. Okay, how, okay, so how insane is it that I can't even see what I'm shooting, but the camera still knows what to grab focus on, right? Nicole, you were amazing. You did good, girl. Can you give a hand for Nicole? We're gonna do another shoot here. You can step down, let me help you. All right, let's bring, let's take up the challenge a little more. You ready? Let's do it. Because it's not enough to not be able to see what I'm shooting. <laughs> Let's bring in a two and three year old too. <laughs> Come on, you guys. Come on. So, uh, let me tell you what I'm doing here. See how I have the back of the chair facing you? I have that because, uh, honey, I want you to come right over here and climb up in this chair and face me. Yes. And I'm going to have you put your arms on this. So you're like, here, I'll show you. Here, you scoot over. This is what you're going to look like. Whoop. I'm gonna sit on your, you're going to look like this. Can you do this? Can you see me? Can you face this way? Yeah. Rain, come on up here. Uh-huh. And can you actually sit up on your knees? Because I'm going to have your sister sit right here next to you. Yeah. 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 There we go. Yes. And come a little more forward. Uh, put your arms here. Yeah, 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 that looks really good. Now let's put your sister right here. Does that sound good? All right. Oh, good, okay. All right. Hi, you guys. Hi. Okay, here we go. And I'm going to do the eye autofocus. Everybody see that? All right, let's get in even closer. Oh my goodness, look at you guys, look at you, you look so good, oh my gosh, this is so, I want to explain something to you right now, what I'm doing is, um, the reason I 
my gosh. Let's look at that. I love that. Oh, let's see. I didn't grab that one. There we go. <laughs> I can't believe like how great they're being. Oh, let's see here. Nicholas, head up. Nicholas, can you look up? There you are. There you are. Where's your dad? Where's your dad? Okay. So the reason, let's talk about strategy. Because strategy is everything with this age. So the reason I have them in this little in this little couch is because it contains them. If I would have put them just on the stage, they would have been like all over the stage, right? The other thing that I'm doing here is I'm creating my own focus plane without them knowing. Because you know how you want their heads kind of on the same plane to get them both in focus? So by putting this here and having him like lean right here and she's up here, they're, they're getting on that focus plane without me having to touch them or maneuver them. Does that make sense? Is that helpful? You can do this on a kitchen counter. You can do this on their bed. You can do it on a big windowsill. Wherever you can find a space that contain this age, it ups your success rate <laughs> with the photos you're taking. OK, let's have dad get in here. So now let's turn it this way. OK, dad, yep. I'm going to have you sit. Come here, sweetie. Come here, come here, come here. I'm going to have you sit on the edge of this chair. Like this? Yeah. Yes. And I'm going to have him in one. Yeah. Up, up. Yes. In your lap. Okay. On that one leg. On that. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Let's just do dad and his son. Can you stand right here with me? All right. She's okay right here. All right. Because I'm going to put her in a second. You good? I think we're good. Okay, here we go. Here we go. And let's see. I'm waiting for my... There it is. Let's go this way so I can see. Let's have you guys get a little closer together. Yes, that looks so good. Nicholas, can you give me a little more of a smile? Oh, there it is. I love that. Ah, Nicholas, where are you? Oh, I love that. That looks so good. How does that look? Is it coming out? Okay, now let's have Isabel get in there. All right. All right, now, Dad, on the count of three, I want you to tickle them. Tickle them as much as you can, okay? One, two... Three. Ah, that's so good. I love it. Oh, God, he got you good. Okay, you see how that is keeping, like, focus on the eye, right? And then I'm able to just, like, focus on Dad and get them, like, laughing and playing together. So thank you guys so much. Let's have one more come up. Does that sound good? Here, Dad. Wait, wait, wait. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go, these two. <laughs> okay, let's have. Yes. Yes. Oh, I can't wait for this one. Hello. Hello. Look at you. Okay. Can you tell us her name? Tell everybody. Okay, here, I'll do it because I have a mic. This right here is Essie. Look at her little, hello, hello. Look at how beautiful she is today. And we're gonna put her, and Dad, if you wanna, if you wanna come up here and stand behind me. Um, actually, I'm gonna turn it the other way because she can't get up. Yeah, she's little, she's little. Look at you. What do you think about this? Huh, what do you think about this? Look at this! Look at this! <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Just gotta wait one second. There we are. There we are. <laughs> what is going on? What is going on? Oh, she's slipping here. Can you hold this?
just really quick. Uh oh, where are you going? Where are you, where are you going? Okay, you got the cutest little outfit on today. I'm gonna move you closer to the light. What do you think about that? Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my gosh. Ah, that's so cute. That's so sweet. Oh my gosh. We just love you. Yes, we love you. Oh my gosh. Are you in love? Look at that. Look at this. Look at this. You're doing so good. So, I don't know about you, but when I was starting portrait photography almost 20 years ago, one of the hardest things would be able to get baby in a position and make sure their eyes were in focus. So I'm demonstrating for you eye autofocus and how it tracks with the Sony camera because it is unreal to me. Hi, look at you, you are unreal to me. That's what's unreal is you. You know what I'm gonna do, Dad? Let's see, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna do this. <laughs> I'm gonna do this. Let's just play for a second. What do you think about that? What do you think about that? Do you wanna get right here, Dad, and like sit right here and just kind of spot her for me? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh. Dad! What was Dad doing? Dad! <laughs> there you go. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Can you bring down the light, hun? Just a little bit. <gasps> Hi, sweetie. Oh my goodness, Essie! <gasps> You did good too. You want a shot with her? Take yeah, okay, take off all this. Brian, can you turn this chair around? Look at that shot up there. Can you see how this feature would change everything for you for that stress with like making sure their eyes are sharp? Okay, look at how handsome dad looks. Okay, let me get this little thread. Okay, pull that, yeah, and sit on the edge of that chair for me. Yes, not any farther back though. Keep and come up even a little more. Yeah, and put her on this side of you. Yes, and, oh, and I'm gonna have you kind of look at her and smile. That's great. Okay, let's get, but Elvin, don't bend down so far. Yeah, I wanna see your profile, there we go. And Brian, you get Essie's attention. Essie! Essie! Essie. Essie. Hi! Essie. Hi! 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 Hi. 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 <laughs> <laughs> and then hold her up a little more cheek to cheek with you. Like hold her whole body up. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's perfect. That's perfect. Oh my gosh. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I love that. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. That's good. Yay. Can you give him a hand? Thank you so much.